Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP, and today we're playing Crusader Kings 2 Jade Biz, episode 148. So we've got a, a lot of weird stuff going on. Why would Germany give up a siege? Oh, that's so stupid. Right, we got a lot of stuff going on. Um, I'm having a really bad pain day. And uh, really, you can't beat me. I guess that's what happens when you load in the game sometimes. But I want to declare one of the Jabrid. Just probably do that then. Part of Semyon, okay. Guess you shouldn't have started that war then. I mean, how is it that Semyon can't be Barbara? Hmm. Weird. So you definitely want to declare on Jabrid if he bails out of the peace treaty thing. Just give it a little time. Well, Australia left the pact. So that's a good war to declare. Huh. There's some people susceptible to trying to do this. Not enough, but some. If all strays you left the defensive pact against me. I, mean, I can only really claim county from him, I think. Unless they use Imperial Reconquest. Vernus is capital, huh? Please tell me Zollerin is in the same castle. <sighs> I'm going to take his capital. I can. I didn't realize that cost me money. Ooh, 
Ooh, they're joining the G Nod for Jerusalem. This is guy's just not gonna leave the defensive pact. Get down here and deal with this. <laughs> He's actually fighting me in the jihad. Now to think about raising levies. That's 20. Four, two, so that's another stack. the Sunni Jihad would come from. to the Roman Empire, all of these people. I can't match Lineal and marry my niece to anyone. Some random courts here. Okay. Whatever, he sends her dynasty. Whoa, that's what I was just thinking! We claim on my empire, how can you even start a war? This is probably just be one giant attrition take here, by the way. Yep, there it goes. This is Jihad for Jerusalem. What are y'all doing?
assuming they're marching an army down my way. I'm not supposed to be fighting Australia, right? Wait. Why is an occupation in Tangier counting? You freaking kidding me? <sighs> Alright. So I'm gonna have to do this the hard way. Thermokites. Got a river crossing penalty, but that's really inconsequential. Verpant alone will conquer that. That settles the global conflict. Are you freaking kidding me? This little schmuck just cost me a county. Hiya. So I can have fun with that. Can I have the bishopric of this? I guess I got a free little thing there. Go occupy this, I guess. Do the Sahara March. Uh, what do I want to do? Oops, have a gift. Uh... I feel like I wanted to do something and I don't remember what that was. War with Australia, right? Get on his capital. That. That will allow me to raise an army to drop onto this guy's occupations of Prussia and unoccupy that for my vassal to be able to occupy it. Control of something in Hamadan? Are you ah. <sighs> Frustrating. These conquests anywhere in the world affect my war score. It's really annoying.
Mali even wants a piece. Is he gonna attack me again? That seems awfully brave. Rasikman. Oh, I forgot to take my men off of uh, nuking themselves duty. That's not good. Thankfully, I suffer no attrition. I'm just trying to think I need to go down there and beat these guys up. Screwball our guys up. Even from our scrubbier people. Probably get at least one death stack out of that. Uh, I don't care about Unix. Welcome to my court. If you're useful, I'll notice you, I suppose. Bishopric of Katagarsi, I don't care about. I, I guess he spent money to build bishoprics there, though. That's pretty cool. Alright, well I want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. It really does help the channel grow. It lets me know what you're watching so I can make more of it. And I really do appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And as always on this channel, La Paz!